I'm your host Trevor Pryor. Joining alongside of me is Bill Granger to get you set up for game one here. It's going to be my first game in the OHL was with Bill and of course he had worked for the Sudbury Wolves and had been an official in the OHA and you know a rookie kid 27 years old uh, coming up from junior C to work uh, in you know in the big time in the Ontario Hockey League uh, was intimidated and Bill just made me feel so at, at ease and comfortable and I had never met him before the, the day we worked on our first game, which was a cool day for me. I not only met Bill Granger, but my first son was born on the same day. So it's quite a wild, wild day for me. But, uh, you know, Bill just had such a calming presence. And, uh, you know, we just developed such a great chemistry over the time that we shared together for 19 seasons. But you know what, more than that, he became such a great friend of mine. And I, I treasure our friendship for the rest of my life. And Bill was the Dean of of color commentators in the Ontario Hockey League, just the best. Hello everyone and welcome to the Sleeman Centre in beautiful downtown Guelph. I'm your host Trevor Pryor along with Stephen Simmons and Bill Granger. What well, what a pleasure it was working with Bill Granger for 15 years on Rogers TV covering the Guelph Storm hockey games. You know, Bill's knowledge of the game was second to none. His ability to cover the game, analyze it from all uh, perspectives was great. His, his knowledge from the referee perspective was very good. I loved his uh, at times when you weren't sure if it was the right call on the ice and he would put it out to the audience that you make the call. Well, for the fans watching, you can be the judge on this one. And what Biggest thing I can tell you about Bill is that he was always very prepared for all his games. He was a true professional about it. He always knew what he wanted to talk about and he knew it and he didn't just have to read it off a piece of paper. He actually studied it and could actually just say it right out of his mouth. And also, Bill had a story for everything. If we were ever lacking on what to show for a few minutes, if there was a pause in a game or something like that, Bill could always fill the time with a story. And they weren't just boring stories. They were good stories that Bill had from all his experiences over his time helping out. He knew everything that was going on in the OHL and he always was able to talk about it and just give a great story about it. I'll tell you a story about this. When I was teaching, Bill's the best. And by that, I don't just mean the best color commentator in the OHL, but also the best to work with. No matter what was happening in the truck or what curveballs we threw at him, I knew Bill would handle them like a pro and he always made us look good on air. And his deep knowledge of the OHL and of hockey meant that I was always learning from him and I think the viewers were too. So uh, I think there are elements at play yet that will move the storm higher in the standings than uh, a lot of people might think, but I think they will challenge for fourth. Ah, uh, Billy, how did this happen? It seems like just yesterday I was this wet behind the ears young buck who had padded his resume to get included on those OHL broadcasts in Guelph. And then I walked into that arena for the first time and I met this guy, Bill Granger, who knew everything, like I mean everything about the Ontario Hockey League and the game of hockey and the Guelph Storm. And he was so kind to me and he took me under his wing and he taught me all of those things that he knew. Well, no, I couldn't possibly learn all of that, could I? But you showed me the way and you were kind to me in the process and I will always remember you for that. In studio with me now is Bill Granger to get you set up and talk about Guelph here, Bill. Bill and I may have got into it a little bit in our intermission disputes, but it was it was all in good fun and it's because we love covering this sport and we love working on Rogers TV and uh, Bill, we miss you here on the broadcast. Hope uh, things are going well for you. We'll see you in Guelph here, I'm sure. Congratulations, Bill, on uh, retiring. Thank you so much for everything you've done for all your time with the Guelph Storm. Man, I feel like the old guy now, which means you're the really old guy. Hey, all the best in retirement, pal, and thanks again for everything. Bill, we really do miss you on game days, but I hope you're enjoying watching the Guelph Storm from your couch, and thank you for everything you did for our productions and for the Royal City. We miss you, Bill and uh, we wish you all your best in your retirement. It was such a fun time to work with you all those years.